everybody. It's Chris here. And Amanda. And we are here doing our weekly Instagram live. Um, we are really, really excited. There are just, well, there's less than 10 days to go now yes. until Professional Beauty uh, North. <laughs> What's the name of our show? <laughs> um, yeah, less than, well, no, just over a week to Professional Beauty North at Event City in yes. Manchester. Um, the biggest beauty show in the North, guys. Oh, so, yes. Yeah. And uh, once again, we are joined by a very special guest. Yes. Um, we will be having one of our speakers, who I yeah. think is ready to join us now. So let us just get yeah. them in to our <laughs> little live. Okay. Drum roll. Yeah, drum roll. Who's it going to be? Who's it going to be? Who's it going to be? <laughs> um, I'll give you a hint. She's in the board room. There we go. I know, it always makes me nervous. I think, please work, please work. <laughs> so, just for everybody, this is Kerry Beavers, and she's an award winning beauty therapist. She won the Professional Beauty Therapist of the Year Award. I want to say 2017. Is that right? Oh, 16. 2016. Oh my God, that was when I first started PB. I remember you winning that. <laughs> um, she's also the founder of the Revive Co. So, she's a home based therapist and also a Pilates teacher. Um, so she's going to be speaking at PB North about how to be your own boss and go mobile. So Kerry, we just thought we'd talk to you a little bit about that topic and give people a bit of a teaser of what to expect from your session at the show. Yes, um, yes. It'd be really good if you could talk a little bit about how do you actually go about starting up a mobile business as a beauty therapist, you know? What, what are the key things you need to look into? Key things. So if you're going to go mobile, key thing is you need to know. I mean, I don't want to give too much away. Oh, I'm... Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but key thing is you need to know your ideal client, definitely. Inside out, you need to know everything about them. Because if you don't know who you're serving, then you've got no idea who to target in your marketing, mm. in the treatments that you're giving. So it's really, really paramount you know exactly that ideal client inside out everything about them so that's number one hundred percent um you also need to be thinking about your branding as well like how you brand yourself are you going to be sort of premium or who you again all kind of that kind of mixes with who your ideal client is but mm -hmm. you really succeed i feel with the scene professional is to have a strong brand yeah. and to have marketing behind you and um, just thinking you're you're just, you know, just a mobile therapist. You need to be thinking that you're more than that and that you're a business. And to be able to succeed, you need to think with your, your business head more yeah. than... Yeah. <laughs> I mean, what do you think are some of the challenges, though, of being a mobile or a home-based therapist? I mean, do you ever feel lonely? Because I guess you're missing some of that, like, camaraderie with your work colleagues. Yeah, actually, that's one of the things I wrote down. 100%. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> my mind there Amanda. Um, <laughs> <laughs> definitely lonely so it's really important that you try and find some kind of support network therapists or other like entrepreneurs business owners that have the same values as you the same kind of work ethic so not people that are like you know grumping about it and going oh this is a hard mm -hmm. life mm -hmm. that you in the right direction um but it, although you're face to face with clients it can be really lonely because you're wearing so many hats, marketing, PR, financial. Mm. Um, no one teaches this stuff when you're training. Yeah. So you can feel really overwhelmed. And when overwhelmment hits, then you kind of procrastinate because you don't know what else, you don't know what to do. <laughs> so, yeah, you need to find a good work definitely <laughs> and what are sort of like so obviously that's sort of like the some of the issues you can face i guess but what are some of like the best bits about being your own boss <laughs> best thing is that you are your own boss yeah. You kind of, yeah it's brilliant i wouldn't i couldn't have it any other way now um it's case of like it's your business your rules mm. you if you want monday off you have mondays off you know it you don't have, to have the flexibility around your life um and it's just a really nice achievement, kind of pat yourself on the back when you're doing well, that you've that you've done this yourself. It's all down to you. Um, it's really, really rewarding working for yourself and the money. You get more money than yeah. you're working. 
But um, I I to ask you about safety as well, working as a home base or a mobile therapist. You know, is there anything in particular you need to be aware of? Because I guess you're not in the safety of a salon or a spa environment. You're inviting, I guess, in essence, strangers into your house. Yes, so you do need to be... Some people, like, I mean, I do treat men, um, and I don't have a problem with that. Actually, men are very loyal clients, nothing to shy away from. Um, but you may find that you want to, like, vet people beforehand, so actually speak to people on the phone. Or you might just want people to be recommended to you. So if it's, you know, wives, friends, husbands, boyfriends, girlfriends, rather than just any Tom, Dick and Harry off the street, oh then... <laughs> then <laughs> <laughs> why you'd feel unsafe but hand on heart i've never had an issue uh, and if you sort of think someone's a bit strange then just don't book them in like always call them and have a conversation with them is the best thing yeah it's sort of about having that kind of peace of mind for yourself that's the main thing isn't it and, and you know kind of if, a, if if it would potentially be an issue perhaps yeah, exactly and you kind of get a gut feeling um and if you're unsure just don't do it really and you can always at any point throughout say no if someone's giving you you know the you just don't feel safe where you're going as well yes. so while, do tell people if it's a new client mm. tell people where you're going and what time you'll be back and stuff so people yeah. are, are it's also a good thing mm. to do yeah um and obviously you're coming to professional beauty north you know why do you think the show's a must oh, oh God, sorry we might have just dropped second i think we're back, <laughs> oh, back. Um, but yeah what i was saying before is you know professional beauty north is just around the corner why do you think it's a must attend show for beauty professionals oh it's just fab it's great to see other therapists start to again build those rapports with people start to actually speak to brands as well so you know mm. especially when you work on your own you're like oh these brands seem really untouchable it can be a bit mm. scary it's nice to have a face behind these brands and you just learn so much like these seminars are fab they're such good value like if i was you i'd just go to all the seminars as well. <laughs> have two days to brands it's just brilliant it's excellent go to definitely Oh, and of course, so yes, as we were saying, you will be one of our speakers at one of the seminars on um, it's Monday, the 14th of October. Yes, on the yes. business skills stage, guys. Business and skills. the session is called Be Your Own Boss Go Mobile at 11 a.m. I mean, if anyone's just tuning in now, Kerry, you know, if you had to sell your session in like 60 seconds, <laughs> <laughs> what would your sales pitch be? <laughs> Gosh, pressure! I feel like I'm on the apprentice. <laughs> <laughs> so basically, if you are mobile, or even if you just work, you're a solo therapist. This session, if you want to sort of start to up level, start to create more business, more money in your business. Bit, uh, uh, I'm getting tongue tied. <laughs> <laughs> well, don't worry, we're not really tongue tied. Yeah. <laughs> um, and you want to create more abundance within your business and. You're feeling a bit stuck. You don't know which way to go. Then you must come along. That 45 minutes, you're going to learn so much on how to become a better business owner, really, and create um, more more money, success within your business. Amazing. Well, thank you so much for joining us, and we can't wait to see you. It's so so close now. <laughs> but yeah, so as we say, um, you can register for your free ticket for entry to Professional Beauty North on the 13th, 14th of October at Event City Manchester. The link is in our bio. And you can also find all the details on how to book all of our seminars, including yeah. the lovely Kerry. So we hope to oh, see yes. you all there. Kerry, I'll definitely see you at the show at some point as well. It'd be yeah. lovely to catch up. Um, but thank you for joining us on our live. And thank you for everybody else who joined in. And yes. yeah, hopefully see you guys next weekend. Yes, and we will be doing lots of lives next week as well. So make yeah, sure to tune in. Amazing. <laughs> well, thank you very much. You see you guys. Bye. Bye.